Hi guys, um, my name's Summer as you might know, but if you don't, that's pretty sad. Okay, so, I'm gonna... What would happen if there was zombie apocalypse? As I was saying, I've been watching a lot of people play these zombie games. And I've come to think, what? Like, 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 do I name them? Like, should I name them? No, nah, not really. Like, like, let me just name two names. The Last of Us and The Walking Dead. Those are both about zombies, okay? I've been, like, watching people play that. And I've played The Walking Dead. So, I was thinking, let's get down to the details. What would happen if a zombie apocalypse really happened? So, about food. What kind of food would we take? Like, do we take Twinkies? No, because they would go stale. Do we take cookies? No, because you're going to get fat and then you won't be able to move. You can take stuff that doesn't go bad, like, uh, what doesn't go bad? Canned food? Canned food. That still has an expir expiration date on it. Actually, for any of you guys who are still yelling about the Twinkie situation, they do go bad. They go bad, I can't remember, it was like 25 years. It takes, no, um, I can't, I can't Wait, remember. Twinkies don't go bad for that long? People say, people have said, like, Twinkies never go bad, they go bad. So, like... Can I take that back? Because, like, what if I'm wrong? Okay. So, when I've said about the food, like, we didn't talk about that. But, like, whatever. Drinks. Water doesn't go bad. So, I don't think it does. Nobody thought that. Okay. But, like, you can take... What? How other drinks don't go bad? Maybe you could, like... Um, see, water is really important. Water? And I think we need, only... like, a life... Like, a lot of water. Yeah. <laughs> okay, just you'll just drink water, okay? But no I'm taking no Kool-Aid. <laughs> As I was saying, no Kool-Aid. <laughs> so let's get down to like, you know, like the things except for like food and water. Well you would need. Weapons. What kind of weapons should I take? Hmm. Guns? But those would be too loud. That's only if like there's not many and there's only like one you go. But, like, if there's, like, a ton of them and you're trying to, like, sneak, like a ninja, you could take, like, mm, what are those called? Chips, you know, knives. knives and stuff. shank them. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, you could also take, like, bombs. <laughs> bombs? Are you kidding yes. me? In The Last of Us, they used bombs. <laughs> oh, another reason. Another reason. I love The Last of Us. That was, like, the best story ever. Oh, Walking Dead was way better. And they didn't use dumb bombs that are louder than guns. Man, they used those to kill people. Okay, I'm getting off topic. So. There's kind of a shelter! You would probably, like, need. Some, like, kind of cave. Because, like, you don't want to be, like, a build a house. Because the zombies are going to know that that's a house. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, you could, like, clear out a cave. Um. Never go in a subway. Those things freak me out. Like, literally, like, a lot of people go on the train or the subway and, like, you never go in a mall. You know what you should do? Go in Walmart and, like, people are saying, oh, this zombie apocalypse, kill everyone. And then board it down. Like, save the children. Next thing, who to trust? Never trust anyone with a mustache. You're probably like, oh, mustache. Also, Never trust anyone, like, that has food. Because once then you eat, like, you don't even get to eat the food. Like, once you eat the food, like, before you eat the, <laughs> before you eat the food, they'll, like, kick you out. And then you'll be like, that food looks so good. We should go kill them. But then you'll end up dying because they have more weapons than you. And, they, like, they have food. Now, listen, all these zombies, like, what they are, like, what they can do... Like if they can Y'all gonna find a like antidote too. They wanna kill Ellie, but I was gonna slap everyone. Yeah, there is a big problem with that. We don't know what kind of um just like powers they will have. Powers. You just take them, chop off their heads, like dissect it, like with the heads. And like you think you like put all these things into their brain and like think what they're thinking and then like, you know, like they're dead, obviously. But like you can do 
Is this recording? Yes. It better be, because I just said a lot of information that wasn't, that was, like, useless. So what I was trying to say earlier is, all these games are based off of facts from the games. What about in real life? What if this actually happened? We don't know if they could hear. Like, we, don't, we don't know if they could see. Clickies! We don't know. We don't, like, we don't know much about them. Like, what if they look like aliens? And we could think, aliens, but they're really zombies. Exactly. And what if the aliens look like zombies? And we call them zombies, and that's wrong. Okay, guys, I hope you like this. And if you become a zombie, I'll still be your friend. Even though I'd probably chop your head off. Okay, bye! <laughs>